Anyway, I'm Sevian, and welcome back to Let's Play... Let's use the key in Legend of Zelda. If you don't know that this is Link, then <laughs> you need to go play a Nintendo game. Level 1, the Gnarled Root Dungeon. Yep. It was under this that I was able to remember that the fact that Gnarled means a root that kind of looks like that one. But, uh... No. I know I can push one of these. Here we go. Go up here. And we got some nice sagely advice. Dangerous to go alone. Take this. There we go. Uh, I can't do a swordless run of this game because, well, it's impossible. Because you gotta pick up the sword to start the game. And I can't go through there yet because I gotta light those torches. So let's go over this way where there's a conveniently placed door that needs a key. I will be trying to get through this game dying as little as possible, which is pretty hard, because this game is hard. I got the dungeon map! Yay! Press, like, most of the dungeons shaped, are shaped like funny things. This is shaped sort of like a top. Or like an upside-down tree, because it's a gnarled root. I keep forgetting that I gotta hit these dudes twice. And they hit me and I can't use my sword. Hey, fairies! Those heal you. Those are what fairies look like in this game. Yeah. We. I am Captain Wooden Ginzu of the Starship Enterprise. To boldly go where no man has gone before. And those things charge at you. That is a bad thing. Push, push, push. Like I said, I, I kind of know how to get through this game. <laughs> I mean, I'm a little rusty in some... It's another Gasha Seed! That was pointless. But, uh, yeah. <sighs> Yay! Boom. And... I got the compass! I'm going to try and get through this entire dungeon in this episode, but that might be a little hard, because walking is a little monotonous. We That means there's something in this room. Well, something important, like a key. These are bombs! Yay! Da bomb, baby, da bomb. Boom, boom, baby, boom, boom. Start. What's up through here? Stuff. Yay. Next time, gadget. Next time. Oh, I don't have a key. Oh, snap. Like I said, I don't remember everything about this game. <sighs> Ow! I just died! This is what happens when you die. I'm gonna continue. Ow. That hurt. <laughs> Uh, you didn't see that. Like I said, this game is... This game likes to kill you. I just say it that much. This game likes to kill you. It's like... It's not... I want to be the guy hard or evil, but... It still likes to kill you. <sighs> Yay! You accidentally go down the wrong path, and boom! You're dead. And then you go to Rainbow Road, and when you die there, you're dead for real. 
Yay, I killed one while on the train cart thingy. Let's slice this. We're not even gotten to the reason why I hate this dungeon yet. Now we can go down that path that killed me. Okay. This could be a room that I'm going to be taking very slowly and carefully. Yes, there's a room that I actually hate in this dungeon. And it's not this one. This one's easy. Watch me die after saying that. Now, this is like the easiest mini-boss in the history of mini-bosses. Come back here, you fairy. After you beat a mini-boss, you get a warp back to the entrance I can be used to warp back here, which isn't too useful right now, but will be in a few minutes. Ow. Like I said, this game likes to deal damage to you. Yay! Now we're to a side-scrolling area. You'll see these a lot more. Side-scrolling areas. Seed satchel. And that's not what I wanted to do. That's not what I... Here we go. Oh yeah, to save your game, hit start, hit select twice, and go over to save. This also will your check. This is also where it'll keep track of all the essences you've collected and your pieces of heart. This is your inventory, and this is your key item inventory. See, I've got a Gasha seed. Yay! And I can set things on fire now. Burn! <laughs> Burn! I gotta go this way again. Yep. Huzzah! This one doesn't take you all the way back to the entrance, but close enough. Alright, what's over here? Presumably an item. Maybe it's a key. Maybe it's not. Yay! Ow. You'll pay for that gadget. Moblin. It's the boss key! Yep, you got boss keys here. And I'm almost to the boss. Almost. Almost is not good enough. Yay! We're almost to the reason why I hate this dungeon. Can you believe that there's a reason why I hate the first dungeon in the game? Yes. Yes. We're almost there. Let's go ahead and kill these guys off. Ow. There we go, trying to check the clock while I'm fighting skeletons. Let's do this. Okay, stand still. Oh, there he is. We've got... These dudes, if they touch you, they'll take you back to the entrance. There we go. You got a ring. Get it appraised later. Nah. You're not worth getting it appraised. No. Me. Mm. Well. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. There. <laughs> and let's go ahead and do this. I've still got time. Hey, that guy looked familiar. Yeah, he didn't to me at first. This boss is insanely easy. See? I almost died. 
No, 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 no. You got a heart container. I got through this dungeon in an episode. Huzzah. Let's go collect an essence of, a of nature. You got the fertile soil. Yay. Whoever made this essence of nature obviously knew the workings of uh, George Washington Carver, who told you to p plant peanuts because it makes things better. And after this little expo after a little exposition, some of the fertile soil has come to me. I too feel stronger. In my dreams, when I saw the temple of seasons in a strange land, I not know. Saw a precious item that will aid you there, so I can see now. Find out more about that next time on Let's Play The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Seasons. Bye!